Hi, on this video we're going to cover how to add profile user extensions to the member directory. So here's our demo site at our website.co.uk, demo.rwebsite.co.uk and here we have two profile extensions, favourite colour and gender. And what I'd like to do is place those onto the directory here so that other members can see favourite colour and gender if the user has entered them on their profile. So a quick review, we're going to have a look here under WPS Pro and Profile Extensions to have a look at the two we've set up. There is Gender and Favourite Colour. And the slug of each is very important as you'll see shortly. So on our site and our directory page, this is what we want to show by the user, Gender and colour. So we edit the directory page. We're going to edit the WPS directory shortcode and add some options. So first I'm just going to clean up some options that are here from a previous tutorial. Actually I'm going to leave include self equals one so I can see myself and I can edit my details. But other than that I'm going to save the default shortcodes for the directory. Now I'm going to pop over to the WP Symposium Pro website here to show how to access the extra information we need. So on the um, www.wpsymposiumpro.com I'm going to go to the How To menu and choose Short Codes. Now on that page at the bottom are a set of links which can take me to more detailed information and I'm going to choose Extended User Information. Which brings me to this page with lots of information about using the shortcodes for profile extensions. But the part I'm interested in is at the bottom called adding profile extensions to the directory. And there are three examples here and the easiest way to do it is to copy and paste directly from the examples. So I'm going to copy this straight off the Symposium Pro website and go back to editing my page. Note that I'm in the text view of the editor here. It means that I'm not going to copy any styles when I copy and paste from a different website. So there's the shortcode I've copied and it's the option here which I want to take across to the shortcode that I have on my page and pop it up there. So I highlight that example, copy it and paste. And I can delete that. Now those slugs that are shown there are the ones, ones that are used on the Symposium Pro website. They're no good for my demo one so I'm just going to make a note there that I've, that I've got to put slugs in place and update the page and then pop back to my profile extensions to remind myself of what the slugs are of the extensions I want to show which are favourite hyphen colour and gender. So I'm going to go back to editing my directory page and in place of the word slugs I'm going to paste favourite hyphen colour at a comma and then gender as the two profile extensions that I want to show. Update the page and flip back across to look at my directory. And now you can see that underneath Simon G I have blue and gender male. But there are one or two other things that we can do to make this look better. One is the layout and one is in adding labels. Here is the example about layout which I can either show as lists one above the other or I can put them next to each other if I'd rather. But I'm not going to use those because I'm happy with them one underneath the other which is the default. But I am going to copy, copy profile extensions labels as the option to define whether or not the labels are shown on the output of my directory. So I edit the page and paste that shortcode option straight in place. Delete what's there already. Now the options I put in here relate to the options in the profile extensions option just before. The first entry, one, will refer to whether or not favourite colour is shown, one being yes. I add a comma and then zero, the second referring to the second option which is gender. Note that I separate each with a comma. So the first relates to favourite colour, the second to gender. So here the first should have a label and the second shouldn't. And here if I view the page I can see that favourite colour has been put inserted but male does not have a label that's gender. If I wanted to show it I would have put 1, 1 into that shortcode option. And Joe underneath here hasn't entered either so they're just not shown. 
And if I've set it up so that I can search for these on the directory, then mail will filter accordingly and still show.